in your opinion, uh, knowing that you have worked in different sectors in Nigeria, how this dashboard can bring an added value for stakeholders in Nigeria as well as other countries because they can use it as a comparison uh, yeah, tool. It's uh, a great question. I think that um, the dashboard is very novel. Uh, we've never had anything like this, especially for tobacco control. Um, and DG does a great job of, of, of thinking about dashboards in the way that uh, it's focused on the user. Um, so our dashboards always reflect what is the country's context. Um, it's validated information and it's shown in the way that people find it. Um, easy to, to kind of make all those comparisons, right? So um, the other advantage, I think, is in the fact that this is a user-friendly dashboard that does not exist in other, that hadn't existed until now. Um, and so uh, being novel is one of its, its key um, highlights, but also being able for people to use it as well as, as you know, it's being used already is great for us. Um, what, how I see that being used comparatively but across other countries is to be able to kind of like use it as a benchmark um, for what is possible. Um, so a lot of, of um, African countries are, are now starting to prefer homegrown data and research. Um, examples that are relevant to countries that have similar contexts with their countries. So for example, in Nigeria, we're prioritizing research that is specific to Nigeria and not examples that are coming from the West, for example. Um, and this is how the dashboard can be used in other African countries. So even as Nigerians, we've taken a lot of examples from Kenya, we've taken a lot of examples from, in terms of, uh, I guess, like what are the, um, what are the um, kind of like country benchmarks? What, is the, what, what countries are doing great in one regard or the other? We've had all those examples on this dashboard and I think that that's the way that other countries can also use this um, information to say, Nigeria is doing it this way, and Nigeria did it this way, and we can do it as well.